what's up guys my name is Lynette underscore ke guys so today i'm so privileged i'm back at villa medellin you can see it right there so we are actually sitting under the shade i'm so happy i'm so pri privileged to be with a nice girl here an african girl african village cook yes yeah. uh -huh. introduce yourself my name is T, African mm -hmm. Village Cook. I'm here with Lynette. You're just chilling at Villa Medellin. Yes, right. I always there. call it Mad Medellin. It's Medellin. Medellin. Yeah. Yeah. So guys, we are here. We just want to talk, do have a conversation. She's going to ask me a few questions. Yes. Yeah. So guys, thank you so much for your overwhelming support. I've been reading your comments, your support, your advice, everything. So guys, today is Teas, African Teas Day. Yeah. So guys, keep it here. Don't keep worry, it guys. Locked. It's so sunny. Uh -huh. yeah. Can we move a little bit? I can move. You're okay. You're okay. Yeah, yeah, me, I'm okay. Yeah. So are you fine there? I'm fine. Yeah. Oh, that's mm -hmm. nice. Mm -hmm. So African tea. Yes. My people need to know you. Okay. Yes. On YouTube, I'm mm -hmm. called African Village Cook. My name is T. Mm -hmm. I, um, I came from Kisumu and I live here in Yabuhanze right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So but why did you move from Kisumu maybe? Uh, the reason why I moved from Kisumu is because I loved Nyabuhanze. I've been watching, I was watching YouTubers mm -hmm. for the longest time. Mm -hmm. So when I came to visit for the first time, I liked it. Oh, you Just liked? the first time. Mm -hmm. I went back to Kisumu. Like for two days, I was like, I can't be here anymore. Let mm. me go back to Nyabuhanze. Then mm. I came for like one month. Mm -hmm. Then um, this one month, I made friends. I liked the weather. It was cool. Like the motivation was just on another level. Mm -hmm. So I decided to move uh, with everything. So I just hired a lorry and ca carried my stuff. Wow. I left my two siblings. I was living with my two siblings. Mm. I left them back in Kisumu because mm. my brother was... Uh, my brother, my younger brother was now able to live alone because he, he's in college. Oh, you used to live with your brother? My younger brother, oh, yeah. Oh, your younger brother. Yeah, and my younger sister who is now 18, oh. but she's finishing her form for. Okay. Yeah, so I used to live with them. So I was like, now they're not kids anymore. Mm -hmm. Let me just uh, take this step and move to another town. Wow. Yeah, and make more for them. Uh -huh. I told them, don't ask me for money until two years. <laughs> oh, why? Okay. Yeah. So you're, you're like, actually investing so that yeah. maybe in the new future, yeah, so if they It'll ask okay. in the future, mm. like I'll have, not that the little I'm making is what they want. So it's like I'm making and it's going, I'm making. So I'm like, just give me two years. If God gives us life, we will now have something big, not the little one and it's going. Wow, so basically yeah. you're just investing on yourself, you're investing on YouTube. And we trust God, by the way, guys, keep supporting us. Yeah. Keep sharing the videos. Mm -hmm. Keep liking the videos. Yeah. That's the only way that you can support us, guys. Yeah, yeah it, was, so. it was a hard decision. Mm. I felt bad that I was leaving them behind, mm. but they understand. I just rented a house for, I mean, not rented, but I just told me, bro, now you you, you now start, start wow. from this point. Because mm -hmm. if you don't start this early, it might be difficult in the future when you wow. get, uh, I mean, older. Just the same way I started. Yeah, I also started uh, just like that. Oh, wow. Yeah. I know the feeling when you're actually living, like you're going somewhere, but you know what? You took a good decision. Yeah. Coming here, you're coming to invest yourself, mm -hmm. invest for them also and also your family. So maybe you tell us about your journey, YouTube, mm -hmm. what you do you do? Maybe, and also if you're a cook, we mm -hmm. have a party coming, right? Yeah. Okay, tell, about, tell us about the party. What's the party. Do I start with now? Okay, the cooking, start. My journey. I okay, think. tell us about what you do well, on your channel. Okay. Mm. My channel is cooking. Mm -hmm. First, when I came to Nyabohanze, <coughs> sorry, I was just doing uh, vlogs. I was doing house videos and yeah, general content. My name was It's Nitty. But then when I came to the village, you know, the village, you have so many YouTubers. So I was like, I need a niche. I need something that I do different from every other person. Cause every every other person is doing vlogs. I was like, let me let me do cooking. Mm. Even though it was expensive. Back then I used to have some little money. <laughs> yeah, so I, I I could go and surprise somebody with lunch. Mm. You you see the less privileged uh, people. Like I was just looking for a niche, like 
I go cook some beef and rice and chapos, like some nice food that you find many people uh, won't afford. Won't afford, mm -hmm. and they eat it like twice or once in a year wow, for, for many. So, nice. so that's what I was doing. It was really nice, but now the problem was moving around. Mm -hmm and spending so much money mm -hmm. uh there's a subscriber who had even got me a, a bike have you seen my red bike i've not seen oh, oh. i came with it here sometimes back oh you guys yeah so there's a Thank subscriber you. who <laughs> got me a bike but the bike was the bike is nice short distance mm. but long distance it was now getting because i go cook uh then ride the bike then i get tired sometimes when i'm going it's slope the the slope is like it's easy mm. but when i'm coming back and i have to walk Mm. The bike is was too much, so okay. The I engine changed. of the then it's it's power. It's about is it one fifty or one hundred? I don't uh, know how they call the it engine. them. Yeah, the engine actually. Oh, it's not the one for in the, the mot nini bicycle. Oh, the bicycle. Eh, the I bicycle. thought it's a motorbike. Oh, no. Guys, she's <laughs> talking about a bicycle. Oh, I said bike. Oh, oh so it's bicycle. Bicycle. Yeah, it's not a motorcycle. Okay, fine. Yeah. So mm. uh, that's what I was doing when yeah. I came. Then I was like. Let me just change the content. Even oh. though cooking for people was really nice, like mm. people were happy mm. and cooking for them. Mm. But then it got expensive. You find that I can use like a thousand two hundred or a thousand five hundred to do mm. a video. Then that video only gets five hundred views and I don't make anything. I can only make like three hundred shillings from it. So it was like the money is going but it's not coming back. So I decided to just do cooking at my place if i cook i buy the food i cook even if it's, if it's a lot i'll have it in my fridge and i'll be eating slowly slowly so i don't like even if i spend a lot it's still i'm not uh kumia in english it's called oh, yeah like you're not going in losses. oh i'm not going in losses yeah yeah, yeah. oh wow that's, <laughs> so that's nice. what i did uh -huh. and uh we waited for maro by the way the, by the way i moved to nyabohanza like four months ago oh to, I got a very nice house, a very nice environment, a safe place. So I'm just living here in Yabohanze. I got to make friends with other YouTubers first. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, of course we watched Marwa and we knew he was coming back for the party. So I just wanted to come and be, just be a member of the community and make friends. And that's what happened. Wow. Nowadays we just cook. I love cooking so much wow. and uh, not that I went to school. I know people are worried that I didn't go to school, mm. but so many things, especially <laughs> in Africa, I don't mm. think we have to go to school to know, to know, to know how to cook. Yeah, somebody say that the person who washes the cars at the car wash, you know, when they wash, then they, they drive it to, to a parking place for mm. the owner to come for it mm. they know how to drive more than the person who mm. went to driving school so okay the same as me mm. uh, i didn't go to catering school but mm. i'm planning to do that after oh, wow. the party so actually i was coming to that point uh -huh. okay mm. you know mm -hmm. dealing with international you know for the party like for the party which is going to come mm. we know there are so many international you visitors. know yeah visitors mm -hmm. who are yeah. going to come mm. so people need to be like to trust you mm. you know mm. we we just go to school to get known Knowledge. Mm. like it's not that we are not knowledgeable mm. we are just going to get more skills yeah like when you go learn about catering you'll mm. know more more yeah, yeah. your what experience you should yeah. Do, mm. yeah how you should, should serve do the it visitors. yeah i will i will i will admit mm. this i oh. don't know how to like serve i mean you oh. know you can know how to cook but no. but you don't know how to Hospi the hospitality. the hospitality like how how should i put the yeah uh -huh. how should i uh you know fold the yeah the, all the, the, yeah. the towels, the, towels, the serviettes. Yeah. Oh wow, that's nice. By the way, I believe in learning. Like mm -hmm. for me, learning yeah. it's just something which is me. Yeah. Like for example, right now, if I can get somebody to pay for me, like I learn something, yeah. I will. It's yeah. like I promised even Ayamara, I'm going to pay for the master class. Yeah. I learn. Like mm -hmm. learning is just an endless, yeah, endless is, uh, journey. Yeah, it is an yeah. endless journey. Yeah. yeah so. Going to school and learning more, maybe more about catering, you get to know I so will, many oh, things. I will. Wow, I wish you the best. I, yeah, thank you so much. Mm. So I wanted to go after this, mm. after the party. Mm. I go and do more like catering. Wow. Uh, and maybe I try to apply and go to outside countries like 
Yeah, you, you can. You Ima services. Imagine people will trust you. Yeah. Having the papers, having yeah. the qualifications yeah. in the hand, yeah. people will trust you. You know, for me, for example, yeah. there was a day I went to another... Okay, I'm a teacher by profession. Mm -hmm. There was another day I went to a school to apply. Oh, I'm, I'm not supposed to look at you. I'm supposed to. It's okay. <laughs> it's, it's on okay. master class. Yeah, okay, uh, Go fine. for the master class, guys. Oh, we need to focus. <laughs> go for the master class and <laughs> learn these things. Yeah. It's okay. Okay, let's focus on the camera. So, so I was telling you, mm -hmm. I'm a professional teacher, mm -hmm. but you know, Corona happened, mm -hmm. and uh, by that time I had not graduated, mm -hmm. and we were pushed to graduate the uh, the year after uh, the Corona pandemic. Mm -hmm. So I was just chilling in the house. Life was so hard, like so hard. It was. It was like I can't imagine going back to I that did? life. Sorry for cutting. It's short, okay. Do you know what I did during the Corona? Season? I don't know. That's when I started to learn business. I was I was scared of human beings. Like me just going to the shop and looking at somebody like this, I was so scared. So that guys let me let me say this. Guys. Let's call it the C season because YouTube might sense it if you say the oh, name. Oh yo, yeah, the C season. Like it. Yeah. So the C season, uh it was it was tough. That's when I started learning and I knew business. By the way, <laughs> during that time, mm. guys, let me just be honest with you. Mm. I had a small kid. By that time, I was breastfeeding. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My dear, girl, it was okay. so tough. Yeah, my girl, yeah. it was so tough. So what I did, mm. the few cash mm. I had, I, I actually called my mom. Mm. I asked her to just support me a lit with a little money. Mm. And then I added with what I had. Yeah, still I was in school, imagine, in oh, campus, yeah. Wow. So what I did, I bought second-hand clothes. Mm -hmm. After bought, I bought the second-hand clothes, mm -hmm. I went to the market. Mm -hmm. So the first day when I was in the market, mm -hmm. my dear, it was a hard day for me. Mm -hmm. Like I was seeing everybody's looking at me, everybody's judging me. Like, I don't know oh, how yeah. it, it feels. Mm -hmm. I felt that. But you know what? God is so faithful. During that day, mm -hmm. actually, I went on a market day. Mm -hmm. So when I went there, I sold so many clothes. Wow. And then I was like, actually, I made the, the money that I used to buy. Like, I made the profit. The mm -hmm. money was back. It's mm -hmm. only that the profit now, mm -hmm. when I go to sell the remaining, the remaining clothes, mm -hmm. it's now when I will get the profit. The profit yeah. So when I was like, like I think it was... It was just a miracle. Mm. I call it a miracle. Yeah. yeah, like from God. Like you can do it. Don't be afraid. Mm. Don't be ashamed. Just mm. do it because you know at the end I, of the day. I, I'm telling you. Yeah. At the end of the day, yeah. you need to eat. You need, you need to, to eat. provide. You need to buy diapers yeah. for the baby. Yeah. So I, I had to do it. Mm. Yeah. I tell people fear is the greatest failure. Sure. Because I remember I was so like scared of other people mm. i could not even if i go to the shop to buy something i wouldn't look at if you ask me did you see so and so mm. i didn't because i don't look at people i was just scared but during this sea season i had to i had a machine a popcorn machine wow. and i had this machine in my house for two weeks so mm -hmm. every day every day i get like stressed anxiety how am i going to start how, oh what am goodness. i going to do mm -hmm. Sometimes I just remove it outside, then I go back to the house, I'm on my phone the whole time, mm -hmm. the whole day, then I bring it back in the evening. So there's a day I just decided, today I'm going, if I'm going to die, these people are going to kill me. That day, I sold so much, just like you're saying you mm. did. So I sold so much and I was like, wait a minute. I don't even have to fear people. Yes. Why am Actually, I, 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 I <laughs> learned that nobody is looking at yeah, me. I was there. like, oh, my <laughs> other students are going to judge me. Yeah, and the fact that, okay. They don't even care. The and fact that I have a... Judge you, mm -hmm. They only judge you for that two seconds. Then sure, they sure, forget. Sure. Yeah. That's yeah. what, by the way, yeah. even when I was starting this journey, I was mm. kind of... Like I said, I need to start, you know. It's not time to yeah. fear anybody. Yeah. Let me just start. Let me face that camera. Mm. I will speak to the, to my people who yeah. will listen to my stories mm. and who will support me. Yeah, yeah so that's how it was. It's, it is. Fear yeah. is the greatest failure. So sure. if you're out there uh -huh. and you have your dreams, you want to follow them. Sure. No matter how, let me tell you, mm. in, on YouTube, mm. in, at, even if you get 500, uh, you know, we, when I, I was monetized, and the CPM is good. With 500 views, you still get your $2 or $3. Oh my God. Will I reach yeah. there one day? <laughs> if the CPM is good, because uh -huh. we are so lucky that the CPM of our viewers here, uh -huh. it's so good. And uh -huh. our company is out there. If somebody in Canada or Europe or US or Australia watches your ad, 
they pay us so well. So guys, thank you so much. Guys, if, please if, take if me there. Monetized, take me there, please. <laughs> if she's monetized, kindly watch watch the ad, ads. I mean, ads. The ads. <laughs> ads. I'm starting to talk like this. It's anyway, okay. Yeah, watch the ads. Mm -hmm. it, it's it's really helpful. Even Kenyans, you, you can watch the ads. Mm. Like, the more you watch, the more the money. Wow. Yeah. So. We can we can't just di di uh, dictate our audience mm -hmm. if they are watching from Kenya well and good. Yeah. If we are, they are watching from international abroad, abroad yeah. yeah, it's well and Thank good because guys. we are just educating each mm -hmm. other. We are getting to know each other. Yeah. So we were actually on your story. It's only that we sh got shifted a little bit. We, we are made... not good at the <laughs> interview thing. <laughs> It's not our it's not thing. Professional. But there was someone who commented and asked me, Ah, yo, did you ever thought of being a journalist? And I was like, Yeah, yeah I don't know. What do you think about that? It's it's good. It's like, do you see me being a journalist? Yeah, a journalist. A, a journalist can, any, can be anyone. Anyone can be a journalist. Uh -huh. yeah. Maybe for the few days that we've been with you. How, like... Like a journalist, like you read news or you... No, it, um, interviewing. Okay, for Interv the few oh. days that I've been here, I've been doing, we've been talking with mm -hmm. the most people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so maybe asking them questions, oh. all of them asking me. And then somebody, Ask by the way, hi mm -hmm. for that person, that <laughs> one person who but told me. But journalism. ID. Oh, you did journalism. I did communication and media technology. Wow. But I majored on PR. So oh, PR. My communication with people, I, I understand. I know how to communicate with people. I'd say it's more of natural than school. Mm. Yeah, I just communicate well with people. I, don't wow. know. I hope so. I oh, hope so. Yeah. yeah. So <laughs> someone told me I need to, like, if, if, for you, if I was given a chance, yeah. uh, I could have did journalist. But mm. I... It was not in my. I wouldn't thing. advise you to do it oh. right now, uh -huh. because the, mm. it's um it, especially in our country right now. You know, any anyone can do it. like let's say Mayugno. Mm. Mayugno, you know, can just go and work on a radio station. Yeah, right actually, he's funny. Mm. He's talkative. He's doing like he's very energetic. Mm. So somebody like that. That's that's the bad thing in journalism right now. If someone like Eric Komondi, mm. it's not. He even, didn't do journalism. Yeah. I don't know if he did. I think he did. He did. There's, there's someone but who did he, not he do was in Destra University. I think he I did. I think he did, yeah. Mm. But there's, there's some people who didn't do journalism. It's just the natural way. Like, Unenda too. I mean, sorry, you just go and work mm. in a radio station. Mm. You just, so it's more of talent nowadays. It's more of talent. <laughs> a few get the job by school. Mm. So I wouldn't advise you. Like people like us, we tried. I even worked in a radio station for oh. a few months. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But the pay was not good because you have to sure. be there. Sure. But they, I used to think that people who are in radio stations, people mm. who are in television that's as journalists and reporters. That's what people think. Yeah, they are being paid well. Isn't it depends it true? on the station. Like oh. if it's citizens, KTN and stuff, yeah. some get paid a million, like a million. Yeah. A million do uh, not dollars, a million dollars, a million Kenyan shillings. Mm -hmm. Some half a million. Like fifteen hundred dollars. Yeah, fifteen hundred dollars. I think so. Right. No. Is it fifty? No, fifty. Ten thousand. Ten thousand yeah, dollars. Almost eight thousand US. Yeah. So some people get paid well. It depends. Like if it's an upcoming radio mm. or these local radios, mm. the money won't even help within a week. It's mm. not much. Yeah. Mm. So I I quit and uh, I don't know. We we lost. We are lost in this conversation, guys. Let let's just <laughs> lost. So okay. I, I did quit that that and went to I worked to the construction company. Mm. Yeah. So just. Construction like we, we get tenders and we build houses like like, like the engineer who is doing this so mm. we get the tender and do that mm. So in that process I also <laughs> now in that process I learned the business and mm. also like opened my supplies company So for okay, you've talked about the construction company mm. like where were you measuring on? Construction company. Yeah, you I worked just, on a construction you know, Oh construction company. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, so yeah. we we do we did the paper thing Oh, the more paper. than the field. So us, we just look for the job. Oh. Like we had that, oh, Marwa wants to build. Uh. We come and apply okay. with our good documents. Uh. Then most probably we'll get it because our documents are good. Mm. The engineer knows how to do the quotation and its amount is good. Like now, and we get it. Oh, so wow. we did more of the paperwork. Then now the engineers, now they go to the field to do their work. Oh, wow. wow. That's yeah. nice. Oh. Guys, did we you hear lost. that? Don't worry Even if about we are lost, the... we are just talking about <laughs> it's life. It's like, life. 
actually no. when you open the camera things just flow no, yeah. yeah so it's not a bad thing it's not a bad talking thing. about your journey it's just amazing because somebody somewhere is getting to learn about us getting to learn about the uh, unemployment in Kenya yeah. the rate at which it's youths are not employed yeah so you've heard from her she learned journalist uh, journalism, journalism right journalism. mass and mass communication yeah. degree a degree wow in university, in university guys yeah, but it's okay mm. yeah. it's fine we need to learn we need to know how we can maneuver the knowledge that we are quite actually guys there are some noise yeah, okay, the knowledge. Generator. Yeah, it's a generator. Actually, they are. Yeah, I think they are used to it at this point. Yeah, you was are used to it because the construction is going on all the time. Yeah, so I was talking about like it's good to go to school even if you don't know where what will come out of it. Mm -hmm. But we get to learn like there are so many things to learn at school. Yeah, yeah your personality, so how to interact. Yes, exactly. So we don't take it for granted. We like we are not we are not following our. How to our, think. Yeah, yeah. Actually, how to think, how to relate with other people. Yeah, so Level many things. Sure. Mm. So, guys, that is the story of tea. You haven't asked me how I'm preparing. Oh, yeah, the actually, party. you're the African <laughs> African cook. You need to be working so, here. I want to assure you, if you're, uh, I mean, I know they'll come and see this. Mm. So, I just want to assure you that I'm ready for this mentally. Mm -hmm. Physically, physically, I also work out, mm -hmm. and we are strong. This heal all the time. You get strong every day. Yeah, I'm ready mentally. The only thing that um, I'm waiting for is uh, Marwa. I am Marwa, our boss. He doesn't like being called boss, but we really like that. It's really important. Yeah, yeah. He's our boss. Mm -hmm. Our boss wants. I mean, I, I, I'm waiting for him. We decide where the kitchen will be at. How we'll plan for this? Uh, we'll hire people to help during the party, mm. but before the party, mm. I'll be able to cook because I don't. It's it won't be like a lot of people. I hope so. Before mm. the party. Oh, before the party. Or even if there's a lot of people, there's so many people who can help. Mm. We can help each other. Sure. I don't. I, I won't be doing it alone. Mm. Yeah. So it's just a matter of preparation, mm. mental preparation. Mm. We are all human beings, and any human being can do anything sure. if you believe. You can do it, mm. you can do it. Also can and cook. Yeah. Mm. And if people are scared, you know, if you're scared, you're worried, mm. you'll get to that point and start messing up. Yeah, I sure. believe in myself wow. and I believe I can do it. Wow, I like that. Yeah, like any other person can do mm. it, I can mm. also do it. Mm. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Maybe you need to do a, like a pre-cook. Let me call it a pre It's I'm just an advice. To, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like do a pre-cook mm -hmm. so that people can get to know like you can do it. Yeah, I'm planning like, to it's like a, a showcase, right? Yeah. And when you're doing it kindly, add, let me be there. Let me <laughs> be there. <laughs> you don't help. I don't want to be helped. I want no, to I want to them. I don't want to come and help you. you can but just I just want to come and sweetness. Okay, you will yeah. And yeah, taste oh, my food. Yeah, also yeah. taste your food yeah. and uh, approve it. Yeah. But I've been taking her food. It is so nice, <laughs> so yummy. <laughs> Off the camera, by the <laughs> way, it's so nice. <laughs> it's so you're so yummy, and she's so organized, guys. <laughs> you need to go and watch her videos, <laughs> right? You. Thank you, guys. African village cook. Yeah, yeah. So thank you so much. So being that you're in our village, you <laughs> need to go to one homestead <laughs> and see what they are cooking. The African food of here Nyabohan. in of Nyabohan, mm. the Korean people. Korean yeah. So if you need something like that, you can just ask me. Mm. You know, I'm a Korean. Yeah. Maybe I'm a tribe mate to Ayamara. Yeah. You can just consult me. I show you the real mm -hmm. uh, indigenous food. Yeah. yeah. The the term indigenous is. Cook, yeah. What we cook. Yeah. It's a surprise to you guys. <laughs> so. I just show you and then you will showcase oh, about it. Right. Also, do you know that That's when people will one. come to, to the party, mm. they, will, they will want to taste the indigenous I food of Ayamara's village. Mm -hmm. Like, what do they eat? You mm -hmm. know, yeah. we have that main staple food. Yeah. Is it staple or staple? Staple. Yeah, staple yeah. food yeah. Yeah. that we eat here. Yeah. So you need to try it also. They will just come like, we need to test. Mm, yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah, so that's thank you idea. 
so much tea Thank you. There's for so being much to say, here yeah yeah <laughs> but we'll cut it short guys sure yeah. so thank you so that you don't stay long here mm-hmm. yeah. so you can just give a shout out and then I'll my finish. name is african village cook mm-hmm. thank you so much for supporting us thank you for the subscribers you're now at 500 and something Mm-hmm. Five thousand, not five hundred. You. Oh, yeah, oh, five hundred. Five hundred and something, almost mm. six thousand. Six hundred. So road to one thousand right now. Yeah. I'm at five thousand. I'm so grateful. Mm. So guys, thank you so much for the support and everything. Mm. Yeah. If you're on my side, you're ah. watching my videos. You can skip one ad, but watch the the rest. Yeah. <laughs> so guys, what actually she's asking for is don't skip the ads for her because <laughs> the ad is the one that. Keeps Sometimes. us going, right? Yeah. Yeah, so Don't it's okay. It's fine. Yeah. So guys, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for everything, for your comment. I always say in my videos that feel free to comment so that I get to learn. Like, yeah. I believe in learning. learning. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so yeah. what you comment, I, I take it. Mm-hmm. So thank you so much, guys. Yeah. Kindly share our videos, leave a sweet comment for us, yeah. and let us know what you think about yeah, there is somebody who is joining us. Uh. Yeah, uninvited, but you're welcome. <laughs> Shout out yourself. Uh, sorry, guys, this is the home of YouTubers. Eh? Yeah. How are you guys doing? We are fine. So, you guys are ending the video? Yeah, we are actually ending the video, but since you came, okay. it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, guys? My name is Chalo Kush. I'm also a YouTuber here. I hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know how long you've been communicating. Uh, 26 be- minutes. Wow. Yeah. That's nice. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please support Lynette underscore KE, African, African Village Cook, Cook, and Chalo Kush. Yes. Yeah. So, so that is it, guys, from here. Bye bye. Thank bye-bye. you. <laughs>